In this video, we'll show you three ways to use the Cache Console to help speed up processing in your class business. The Cache Console is available at the business level and the fund level. You can access it by going to Transactions and Cache Console. We're going to look at the business level. The feed mode shows all transactions that have come through a data feed on a particular day. It won't display transactions that have already been matched by Generate Income, Auto Match, or the existing Vault transaction rules. You can use this function on a daily basis as a first point of call to identify where new transaction rules can be set up. You can also classify most transactions from here uh, using the classify function. The all cash mode will display all transactions for a particular time period that you've selected. The results are limited to 1000 transactions. So it's best to select a short date period or to add something in the search bar to filter the results. Any descriptions that is going to show up in different entities across your client base. Make sure you've clicked refresh once you've selected the description. There are then two features that you can use within the cache console. The first is create transaction rules in bulk. You should use this for any transaction that you want the system to automatically match off in the future. So for example, we may want to look at all of the transactions that say accounting fee and select those and create a transaction rule in bulk. We can modify the description as needed and then create the rule from here. The other alternative is to use the bulk classify cache. So if we have a description such as ASIC, where we don't necessarily want the system to create a rule in bulk because we might have a component that's a penalty, we can filter the amounts and match off the ones we want using the bulk classify cache. This will just match off as a one-off event, but it will allow us to make sure that we're matching off the correct transactions. The third feature that we have in the cash console is the bulk generate income. This is particularly useful where the payment amount changes after the announcement date. So some examples are Australian shares that pay a dividend in a foreign currency, such as BHP. Because the amount on the announcement date is different to the payment date due to the foreign exchange difference, you should use this feature to bulk generate income for all the entities that hold that particular security. Once you've selected that security, you can click on create income events and auto match. Once you've done that, you should wait until it's completed before you try and match off another one. And you'll see a success message and you'll be able to download a log that tells you which entities it is updated for. We encourage you to use the cash console at the business level, even if you're still processing your entities on an annual basis, as you'll find efficiencies and improve the automation of your processing. Thank you for watching this video.